What is up fellas? Thought it'd be uh, time to do a bit of an update video. Just haven't uploaded in a while and thought it'd be good to touch base. Um, I have been working on the car, but stuff I've been doing haven't really been super exciting. Not really case swap related stuff, just chassis shit, but I'll go over that and show you what I've been up to. Um, but yeah, I was actually gonna try to take the car to um, some New Year's Eve skids at my mate's place. Um, so I found a manual box for the 20E. Um, got it down but had trouble bleeding the clutch up and I think I had two masters here actually but I think they were both stuffed so we didn't end up getting that done so that would have been a cool video but um, I'll chuck in uh, my mate's 30 debt lorry fucking grabbing fifth so you get a little bit of juice in this video but um, yeah I'll just go over what I have been doing and, and what we're going, going to be doing soon. Um, I have actually got my motor looking pretty schmick. Um, so, got my rocker covers all painted. Um, you can kind of see it's a factory Laurel car with the factory pearl and everything. I just put a bit of flake into it. And also that sump that I was designing, got that all folded and welded and everything. So pretty wrapped with that. Um, I haven't bolted it up fully yet. Um, but yeah, really stoked with that actually. That was kind of the, the big hurdle with the swap. Um, so, mounts are made, as you've seen, got the sump done, now it's really just a matter of buying, oh, I've got my uh, rear wheel drive box and all that, but I need to buy a clutch, so buy a clutch, um, intake, throttle body, alternator, all that type of stuff, a few belts in that, um, core packs, that sort of thing, got to figure out what I'm doing exactly for an intake, and, and I'm not sure, still not sure yet whether I'll run it NA first, um, it would be good to just get it in there and, and going, but what I am doing with the car is trying to get the chassis all, all done before I try to put the motor in. So we are now manual, which is cool. Um, I'll just turn my flash on and go in there. So the car's manual now. Um, another thing I'm real stoked with is this handbrake setup. I, um, I didn't want to... Like I want to keep it looking as factory as possible in here and I didn't want to buy a manual one of these because they go for like over a thousand bucks for like a good one which is insane because um, obviously the auto has got the the foot brake and the release here so I'll maybe put some switches in there or something but just mounted this guy in here so I've got some lines for that um, so yeah it's just sitting there well it's bolted up but I haven't done the lines or anything so we've got that to do. Uh, I need to properly mount at least the rear half cage. Um, this is my mate's seat. I'm trying it on. It just doesn't really feel how I want it to feel, but might run it for a little bit. Um, but yeah, like I say, just trying to get all the chassis stuff done so I can at least take it for like one or two rips, just manual 20E, and you know, get rid of all the teething problems that I might have with the chassis so that I don't experience like motor teething problems and then chassis teething problems at the same time uh, but i have driven up and down the road and all the rear end with the axles and everything works mint so i'm hyped on that and then at the front here oh, just holding the motor up um and i've got my subframe and rack out so i can uh relocate the rack so i'll be doing that but once again like i didn't really think it was uh, necessary to film that because there's hella videos on YouTube of, of doing that. So let's just chill in there. Got some, um, where are they? Got some, where the fuck? Well, I've misplaced it, but I've got some extended tie rods, one under the box there, I think. Um, just to make up for that roll center correction kit and stuff. But yeah, no, I just thought I'd touch base, so. I'm actually going to Japan in a few days. Um, so if you won't be able to work on the car for like a couple of weeks, but get back into it in the new year. Really hoping to get this in there pretty soon. Should have the chassis all sorted in, in a few months and then, yeah, we'll start going hard on this. I've got a bit of fab work to do, but looking forward to it. Um, but yeah, thanks for, thanks for watching the videos as always and um, I'll see you for the next one.